our project is, is looking to re recover as many metals as possible from electronics. And so we've developed this flow sheet uh, with the process. And this flow sheet involves recovering the rare earths, uh, steel, uh, the base metals, uh, including copper and tin, and precious metals. And we have various processes that we've actually uh, developed to do recovery of all these materials. We start taking into account the properties of the material. We initially perform a separation based on magnetic properties. We separate the ferromagnetic material for the material that is non-magnetic. The ferromagnetic material is the one that is rich in rare earths and we proceed to, re to the rare earths extraction separately. While the other material that contains the base and value metals, we start removing the base metal using an electrochemically generated oxidant that is specific and targeted for, this, for those base metals. So we leave the precious metals such as gold and palladium on the, on the electronic waste that was not removed and the chemistry for the treatment of precious metal is very well known and that's what we are, that's our way to, to enrich this material. This uh, project is important because it, there are rare earths in electronics and this rare, these rare earths, while there's, there's an amount in there, they're not a great amount and it's not economically viable just to recover the rare earths from these materials. And so this project, what it does is actually a, it encompasses a, a larger array of materials that include precious metals and these precious metals allow economic viability for the whole process. It's important to recover these critical materials because while there's, they're not necessarily rare elements, they're very hard to get in nature and it involves a lot of processing that involves a lot of chemicals and it also moves a lot of land around. If you can recycle these materials from electronics, you can actually skip a lot of those steps and put them in the stream at a higher level and you don't have to do a lot of those extra steps. So it's more efficient.